Hey Jackals fans, Blue the Bat Boy here, live from Skyland Stadium for your Jackals pregame report. Yesterday the Jackals beat Sussex by a score of 2 to nothing. Starting pitcher Justin Brantley tossed six dominant innings, followed by Reese Corrales and Dylan Brammer to close it out. Nelson Ward also put in a defensive display yesterday as he made several solid plays. David Harris' two-run shot in the second scored the only runs for the Jackals and was enough to seal the deal, earning himself the PSENG Power Player of the Game honors. Here's what Justin Brantley have to say about that big victory. Uh, yeah, yesterday went, went pretty well. Uh, we got a W. Um, I kind of I tried to fire up the current team a little bit early in the first inning, try to say, hey, like, give me two runs and we'll be all right. And I was just trying to put a little fire into him. And it, I mean, Harris went out and hit that two-run homer, which was huge to get at that lead. And, um, pitching with the lead, it's I'm just trying to throw strikes, and it's a big park, so you can't hit a two-run homer with no one on base. So uh, at that point, and Ward and, and, and D out here making some great plays. Uh, it was an overall great team win yesterday. Um, we put the pressure on them. We were up in the dugout the entire time. Uh, Reese and Brammer did their thing like normal. Um, so hopefully uh, we took the big, it was big to get a, a, an extra game up there. So we're up 2-1, and the pressure's on them now, and hopefully tonight we can finish it out. The Jackals are now 2-1 in this championship series, one more win away from winning the Can-Am League championship. Tonight, the Jackals will send right-hand pitcher Christian Tessitore to the mound to face the Miners' righty, David Palladino. Both pitchers have been solid this postseason. I'm Billy the Bat Boy, and that's your Jackals pregame report.